Okay. You know, there's some people who say our show isn't very educational, but um, I think you can actually learn some things. And so one of the things I want you guys to know about is from the Chronicle of Craig Kay. Take a look at this. I learn something every week when I do this show, and welcome to Rudy's Room, by the way. I, of course, am your host, Mr. Rudy. I did not know that you can't drive in the HOV lane with dead bodies. That actually happened in uh, Las Vegas, Nevada. Look at that. Yes, that is the brand new HOV lane that was installed. It is a multi-million dollar project that opened up actually on May 20th. And so believe it or not, there is a funeral director in southern nevada who actually was driving i think we have another image of this thing he was driving this hearse with the body he and the body in the back were driving in the hov lane and he thought that that counted as having a vehicle with two or more people <laughs> um unfortunately not when the police pulled him over and gave him a ticket he was surprised to learn that and i thought well i mean a body is a body i would think you know who knew so you learn something new every day we've learned all kinds of things from our drag queens we've got some wonderful guests tonight who are going to teach us some stuff and most importantly the cookie lady hi miss yolanda you taught us all about the d meeting the knees but we will discuss that later folks rudy's room starts now on strong island tv Welcome to Rudy's Room. I, of course, am your host, Mr. Rudy. We've got some fantastic guests for you tonight. It's going to be fun. We've got up first the lovely Cynthia, the Bling Queen. Let's make Yay! some noise. Yes. Yes. You are very blinged out. Blinged out. Yes, I I'm am. I'm loving the bling. Well, thank okay, you. Okay, we will discuss that in a minute. And, of thank course, you. we've got Daphne, who is très chic. Daphne, how are you? Good, excellent, well, thank excellent, you. excellent, excellent. Daphne, what is Trey Chic? Trey Chic is a brand that just simply says that we are all chic. Mm -hmm. Okay. We can be chic at all times. So it's some just, people aren't just chic. No, we are okay. chic. We are chic. Okay, we are chic. <laughs> we have chic. to say it that okay. way. Okay. Does chic happen? Sh chic always happens when we <laughs> rise above it. Okay. And we have a wonderful time and looking beautiful while doing well, it. Well, you look amazing, and Thank I'm you. loving the outfit. It's Thank fantastic. You. It's summertime. Okay, <laughs> like that. Now, have you always, Cynthia, have you always been a bling queen? Were you ever a bling princess? No, actually, I started my business uh, just in January, okay. so I'm new to it. Mm -hmm. However, I am so in love with paparazzi. Okay. Everything bling. They're the $5 jewelry people, right? $5 bling queen. Okay. As you see, yes, mm. my necklace is $5, my bracelet is $5, my ring, and the necklaces come with matching earrings. So 5, 10, 15, 20, or the two earrings count as one? No, they count as one. Okay, 15, <laughs> ooh, for 15 bucks, you can get all of that, okay. Yes, you can. Okay. And, I, and then some. And then some. Yes. I'm loving it. How much does it cost typically to be chic? So typically to be chic, our prices range anywhere from twenty to sixty dollars. Okay, that's not bad. No, not I can, at all. Listen, We're you can chic on a budget. That is affordable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's our okay. whole motto: is you know, high-end costume jewelry at affordable prices. I right. love that. God, yeah. welcome both of you to Rudy's room. You are brand Thank new you. Rude Rangers. Yes. And so what that means is you've got to take our little pledge. Are you guys Ooh. ready? Yes. Okay. Okay, because you're not official yet. So hold up your right hand okay. and repeat after me. Ready. Okay. I promise. I promise. I promise to live my best possible life. To, to live, live my, my best, best possible life. life. To avoid all unnecessary drama to avoid, to avoid all, all unnecessary, unnecessary drama. drama to stay away from messy and extra people to stay, stay away from, from messy and, and extra people. people to only clap back when necessary to only, to only clap, clap back, back when necessary. necessary to stay current and woke to stay, to stay current, current and, and woke, woke. And to look my absolute best as often as possible. And to and look to my, my absolute, absolute best, best as often as possible. as possible. Last but not least, you don't have to repeat that part. Here we go. You will always support those who support you. I will, I will always support, support those, those who that support, support me. me. Absolutely welcome to the Rude Rangers, ladies. You. you guys are new members. 
We are very, very glad to have you here. Um, you both have your phones, correct? Yes. yes. So what I want you to do, and all of you out there in the audience, please, we want you to like the Strong Island Television Facebook page, share our show, tag a friend or two who needs a good laugh. We want this thing to go viral. It is very, very important. So please do that. And those of you out there watching, please comment on the live feed. Ladies, of course, will be sharing their websites and links so you can order some of this great stuff and be chic and bling and everything else that they do. Very, very important. Um, okay, Rangers, Rude Rangers like yourselves now, mm -hmm. um, they like our show, they share our show, they are fantastic. We've got a couple of uh, Rangers out there, so let's see what the Rude Rangers want to talk about. You guys ready for the roll call? Sure. Yes. Let's do it. Rude Ranger roll call starts now. Yeah. Okay, that Dave guy is awesome. Yes, Dave Agsteribi was a guest last week. He was awesome, and I'm glad that he thinks that he's awesome. So good for you, Dave. <laughs> you like yourself. What's next? Uh, oh, yes, pop your back out. I can't. Okay, LaBelle Bell. Uh, last week we had a guest, the lovely Loretta, who is a songstress extraordinaire. I was talking about Wendy Williams, and of course Wendy's got this new boyfriend who, I mean, he's practically a teenager. And so Loretta said it didn't really matter as long as he's popping Wendy's back out and she's doing what she needs to do. If she needs to rent it, go for it. So mm. good for you, Loretta. Okay. What's next? Uh, good show. I like it. Thank you, Jeff Shepard. We like you. What's next? Okay, uh, we're having a party. That's right, we are having our passion party on July 25th, and one of you ladies is actually going to be there. Okay. Ooh, yes. What kind of bling are you bringing? I'm bringing all the bling. All the bling? No, um, no stones unturned. Okay. I am, my inventory is okay. to die for. Well, well, bring the bling, and we're going to have a great time. We've got LaBelle, we've got Olivia, we've got a lot of other ladies, we've got some fantastic vendors, and the crazy cookie lady will be there. I heard. <laughs> yeah, she will be there, bringing the D to the knees. Well, not at that party, but that's a whole okay. other thing. All right, you guys, there are a couple of things important that we need to talk about, so let's do a little word on the curb, because there's okay. a lot going on. You ready? Got it. Let's do it. Oh, first and foremost, our hearts go out to the family and friends of Lee Iacocca. A lot of folks don't even know who he is anymore, but he was the man who actually uh, was credited with basically saving the Chrysler Motor Corp back in the day. Do you remember Lee Iacocca? Yes, I do. Yeah, and also he, you know, is popular for the minivan. So back then he kind of made it chic, which yeah. I don't understand to drive a minivan, but yeah, me people either. love it. I know, listen, I, it, it happens. Go. <laughs> Sorry, Lee, although he was 94, God bless him. Uh, oh. Also, Beth Chapman, the wife of Dog the Bounty Hunter. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah that, that was so very sad. sad. Yes, so her, what? I, yeah, I mean, I did like her. I'm not fond of him, but no, that's a whole yeah. other thing. But her ashes were recently spread along the water in Waikiki during a oh. private paddle out. As beautiful as that is, I don't know if I want to be in that water after that. What do you think? No, I definitely would Right? Not. Yeah. No. I, yeah. But do you know... People swim in the ocean. We have no idea what's floating. Out. I don't sure want to think about it, but uh, now that they told yeah. us that she was scattered out there, <laughs> I, I, her and a whole we'll bunch forget. of others. You'll forget. I'm gonna try to forget. You'll I mean, I ain't getting the Waikiki, Waikiki anyway. <laughs> True. My budget with this show, I can barely get to Elizabeth, New Jersey, but that's a whole other thing. <laughs> well, I can um, help you out on that one. We're gonna talk about. Oh, okay. You bling and you travel. Listen. Okay. Don't sleep. Multiple streams of income yes, over multiple, here. Multiple. Okay. Multiple. How much paparazzi you selling? I'm selling enough. <laughs> 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 okay, I like that. Okay, oh, uh, you guys, the People's Princess, Meghan Markle. I love her. They, I, I do too, Why but they, they, come, with her? they keep messing with her. Apparently, she is now um, in the process of hiring her third nanny in six weeks. And so she people. Good help is hard to find. It is hard Hello. to find, especially when you're a princess. And I yes. feel like some of them are probably challenging her up in that castle, don't you think? Absolutely. I think the yeah. shade is real. Yes. So, yeah. She has to put but her foot down. But she's holding her own. Mm -hmm. yeah. she, listen, she's holding her. Listen, she's holding her own. I also personally, I mean, I, I, I get where some people are talking about this whole thing about how she's always hiring different staff and can't keep people and stuff like that. But when it comes to that baby Archie, listen, that's a security. She's very particular. He, she's particular, and listen, he is residual income. I would make sure Absolutely. he's all right. And not only that, have you? You notice that she keep her mama around? I like that. You always keep your mama around. You do. You? Mm -hmm. Listen, she there's does. only one part. You can't have them friends. No. Because mm -mm. you, you know what? And a drunken night with Prince Harry, <laughs> who has his ways. Mm -mm. Yeah, right. Mama's can't not doing about nothing. That. No. Not doing mm -hmm. that. You can't forget no. about that. Keep mama. Keep the circle tight. Mama's right there. That's true. Mm -hmm. And keep all them other half sisters and whatever who was just oh, messy no. away. So, all right, Megan. So there's that. The other thing. Oh, little Nas X. Let's give a round of applause for oh, little Nas X, yes, the rapper. I like that song. 
I love that song. We love he Old Town recently Road. came out. He did. He really did. And I mean, congratulations to you. Um, he recently came out while he was on tour with Miley Cyrus, um, basically announcing that he was gay. So, uh, I mean, to each his own. To Prime. each his own. Uh, I'm surprised people even care at this point. It feels like at this stage of the game, who yeah. isn't? Because exactly. I mean, people, men with men, women women, dog, everything. It's just it's um, it, it, everybody's doing everything. I think it's but a publicity song. Uh, something. It's something. Go figure. All right, and then one of the last things we're going to give it up for Mr. Anderson Cooper. Now, Anderson, we are very sorry about the death of your mom, Gloria Vanderbilt. Oh, yes. Yes. But that will was red, and Anderson's getting everything. So everything? Everything. Oh, not that he needs it. <laughs> You, can always, you, can, always you can, always can always have more. You can always have yes. more. always have more. Yes. So apparently when he was younger and for most of his life, his mom said that she didn't believe in inheritance, so she wasn't going to be giving him anything. Okay. So he wow. went through life and his career and everything not expecting to get any money. So he was so driven to make it on his own and do stuff. Wow. But um, Gloria kicked the bucket. They did the reading of the will, and he got everything. So he is a very wealthy man. Good for I him. Know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think so. He has a partner. He does have a partner. Listen, right? Doesn't he have children? No? He doesn't have children, but I think he does have a partner. Okay. So, but there's well, still hope. Listen, yeah, you never know. You never know. Mm -hmm. You're just a paternity lawsuit away from making all your dreams come true. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, right? It is true. Very quickly before we go, how can people order Trace Chic? Like, do you have a website? Do you have a phone number? What do they do? So, with Trace Chic, all you have to do is go on Instagram. We are Trace Chic DBC mm -hmm. at Instagram. Okay. And um, just send me a message. You can see all of our photos. We're constantly uploading our new items. Okay. And just reach out. We also do events, um, and we do parties too. So just reach out and let us know. One of pe one of the people from our staff, they'll get back to you. Okay, well, her staff. We're gonna find out how large that staff is in just a minute. <laughs> and how do we become blingy like you, my dear? I am an independent consultant, so I have my own um, website, which mm -hmm. is www glamourgirlgems.online. Okay. You can order personally right from that website mm -hmm. and ship directly to you. Okay. Three to five business days. Three to five business yes. days. Can you get overnight? Because what if you got an event to go you to? You can get overnight. Okay. If you really need something. Because you know there's a lot of last minute people out there watching. If you need watching. something that pressing, <laughs> okay. you can follow me on Facebook. You can also follow me on Instagram. Okay. Um, my personal phone number is six. Uh, what the killer is out there? Are you sure you're gonna get your number mine. out? Six three one seven zero four nine one nine four, and you can just hit me up, and I'll get in touch. Definitely, with you. she I'm is gonna, better than you and listen, me. Listen, she's got them bloody shoes. On, I guess. <laughs> she's good. She is covering. She you is covering that. We will be right back after this short commercial break with more Rudy's room here at Strong Island TV. Don't go anywhere, you guys. someone you know is in the area and you want to see our show order your free tickets today go to www.rudysroomshowtickets.eventbrite.com
Ah, welcome back to Rudy's Room here at Strong Island TV. We've got Cynthia with lots of bling. We've got the lovely Daphne. Daphne, Bianca Brooks, who's watching. Hi, Bianca. She says cute Hi, yellow Bianca. dress. Uh, do you mind telling her where you got it? Hi, Bianca. It's actually a jumper. Oh, um, st stand up and jump. <laughs> it's a one-piece jumper. Oh, look at you. Woo. So it's a jumper. Everything okay. that I have on is actually available at Trace Chic. Okay. Oh, wow. so, um, all right. Again, all Now, does Trace Chic fit us all? So Trey Chic does fit us all. We okay. usually can go up to about a 3X. Okay. Oh, all right. Yeah, I definitely try to have sizes for everyone. That is phenomenal. That's yes. a, do you mind so, if we ask about how much this costs? So this piece is about $50. No way. That's a good deal. Again, we try to be affordable for everyone. That's, That's the whole fantastic. point of it is that everyone can be chic at any time. Okay. Very, you know? very nice. Okay, yeah, look at that. Thank you. Thank you. And Julia Montero Johnson, who's watching us from Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Yes, I think a body is a body, and there is no reason why they shouldn't be able to drive in the HOV lane. <laughs> uh, go figure. And hell, uh, can you both say hello to LaBelle Bell, who is watching us at home? Hi, LaBelle. Hi, LaBelle. Yep, you hopefully both will see LaBelle at the Passion Party. She's yes. one of our performers. LaBelle, so I can't wait to see you. I know, you. we can't wait to see you too. Okay, you guys, life is full of difficult choices sometimes, and this is actually the first time I've got to meet both of you. Mm -hmm. I'd like to get to know you a little bit better so I want to figure out kind of how you both operate with that being said we're gonna play would you rather I'm gonna pose you each some scenarios and you've got to tell me which one you would rather do so you ready to play a game oh yeah I okay. guess so. let's do it an audience <laughs> yeah. of course you People can always nervous. play along hi Aurora I'm love workman all right let's play our game Okay, ladies, would you rather work as a personal assistant for Diana Ross or Mariah Carey? Diana Ross. Oh, why Diana Ross? Grace. Okay. Uh, and Daphne? I, I would also rather work for Diana Ross. Now, why would you not want to work for Mariah? I think mm. Mariah might be a little much. She's, a little, she's almost <laughs> she's like new extra. money. I prefer yeah. old money than gotcha. the new money. Okay, okay. But she's you don't think Diana extra. could be a little much? Because I think she's Absolutely. still stuck in the... the, the Absolutely, but okay. I think I could do... You yes, can Miss Ross, Miss Ross. Yeah, yeah okay, I'm you learning can, okay. from Miss Ross. Okay, you can yeah. respect Mariah, the legend. on the other yes. hand, she's almost like my oldest sister. Got you, okay. So it's like, just have a seat. <laughs> <laughs> Diana Ross is aged with perfection. She has. Absolutely. So you get to learn a lot from that. She's okay. iconic. Okay, she is iconic. Okay, very nice. What's up next? Oh, whose wedding would you rather plan? Jennifer Lopez or Danielle Staub from The Real Housewives of New Jersey? Now, we both know neither marriage is probably going to last, but... Mm. I would Ooh. rather do Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. You would, okay. I saw Danielle when she was getting married. Yes. On The Real Housewives mm -hmm. of New Jersey, too and much. it was a mess. It was a it mess. It was too much. She was fighting with her best friends. Yes. It was over the top. Okay. So, J-Lo, I'll be proud. J-Lo all Happy the way. Happy to execute okay. whatever it is that she wants. Would you get J-Lo a wedding gift? So I would get Jayla whatever she wants. Really? I, mean, I would get her a wedding gift. I hope she invites me when she comes back from the honeymoon okay. to the house so that okay. we can have some cocktails. I like with that. With A-Rod yes. and the kids. Okay. Now, do you think this one is going to last with J-Lo? Because you know she is the Puerto Rican Elizabeth Taylor, they call her. We loved Elizabeth Taylor. We need to love J-Lo the same. Okay, I like that. Yeah. And Cynthia, okay. I, I believe that this one's going to last. You do? Yeah. Okay. I think he's a keeper, mm -hmm. and I think she's going to keep him. Okay, then yeah. we'll see what happens. What's up next? Oh, who would you rather be trapped in an elevator with for oh. hours? Cardi B hours? or Kim Kardashian? If you're stuck in an elevator. No, I can't do Cardi B. That voice I, would just get to me. I think Should that I, Cardi B would be good for just a little bit of time. So okay. I would say Kim Kardashian for hours. Okay. Because I could see us okay. talking, okay. playing games, mm -hmm. taking selfies. chatting, taking selfies, talking about baking cookies, whatever it is. Okay, so you can handle that. What about you? Kim Kardashian. You would. Because she has the business mind also. She does. So if you just sit her down, I mean, get a calm for a few minutes. You might learn something. Millions and I'm millions for doing fan. nothing. I'm, I'm a fan a huge too. I'm fan uh, of that. You know, I want to be trapped with the mother because that's the ringleader. Isn't she yeah. amazing? I mean, and what she was able to do with her what? whole family yeah. and the kids, they're like, it's seriously. That's about termination. Great parenting. That's uh, how I see it. Uh, listen, you took a sex tape and made you billions. You took a lemon it's and you amazing. made that lemonade. Yeah. What? A big button, a sex tape. Took it all the way. All right, Sorry. what's up next? Oh, who do you think gives a better gift, Oprah or Tyler Perry? Ooh. Oprah. Oh. Why do you think Oprah? Oprah. Because she's she's thoughtful. Okay. She's thoughtful about her gift giving. You don't think Tyler thinks? I think he does, but I think he, he doesn't 
do it himself. Okay. He has somebody do it for him. Okay, so you think Oprah actually goes and gets the gift? I think she thinks about it. Okay. I think, <laughs> she yeah. thinks about thinking about what to tell someone yeah, to get the gift. Yeah, to tell somebody, yeah. Okay, This is gotcha. a really tough one. It is a tough I one. I think that mm -hmm. Tyler also is extremely thoughtful. I yeah. think he came from, you know, like humble beginnings. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So he's all about blessing people and paying yeah. it forward. Right. And Oprah the same. Yeah, yeah. So it would really be hard for me. I think I could choose either one and really be okay. happy. Fairy okay. godfather or fairy, fairy godmother. Gotcha. <laughs> so, so is there one that you would, if you had to choose, no. look at that, I love that. If there's one you had to choose, who would you rather get a gift from, Oprah or Tyler? You don't know what the gift's going to be, but one of them is going to give you a gift. Who it might be Tyler. Okay. Oprah. You want Oprah. Okay. All right, we'll I leave it like that. Oprah. You still want Oprah. Okay, I like that. What's up next? Who would you rather manage your kid's career? Matthew Knowles, Beyonce's dad, Joe Jackson, God rest in peace, or Chris Jenner, who we just talked about. Chris Jenner. You want Chris Jenner? Absolutely, Chris Jenner. Yeah, but Joe yeah. Jackson made a, a an, an icon. Sorry, yes, Joe. But, but look what he did. Yeah. I oh. mean, mm. it's it's not what you do, it's how you do it. Okay. And none of his kids if talk. If a couple of ass whoopings brought us all that beautiful music, I mean. <laughs> none of his kids talk nice about him. True. And, you know. Okay. Everyone has their scars. Gotcha. They have a lot. They do. Yeah. That is true. You know, okay. and then All it's right. out in the public eye. Gotcha. Okay, so we're going with Chris Jenner? Yes. Okay, we're Hands going down. with Chris. Chris, call <laughs> us, please. 516-945-9099. Uh, you can put any of us on. What's That's up right. next? Love you, Chris. Oh, who would you rather have your back in a crisis? Annalise Keating from How to Get Away with Murder, Olivia Pope from Scandal, or Cookie Lion? When it's about to go down, who do you want right next to you? You know, when it's about to go down, Cookie handles her business. She does. She handles the She family. does. She has, she takes care of it all from A to Z. She does, okay. And okay. Elise kills way too many people. Uh, well, she technically doesn't kill anybody. No, she the gets people everybody around off. Right, she does. Annalise does. She, she, she gets, gets off, everybody though. off. She, she gets, gets you off. off. She does. She gets you I, off. I, she does. I, I, Mm, so I'm he, leaning a little towards Annalise. Annalise, Annalise yeah, going to keep you out of jail. Annalise gets you off. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, so we want. So you want Annalise? Annalise gets you off. And you want? Annalise gets you off. Annalise does get you off. Okay. Annalise all right. Yeah. Off. Yeah. Now, there's a physical a fight. I want Cookie because Cookie will yeah, like she throw down. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you cookie, need your ride or die. She, yeah. Cookie is ride or die. All right. Yeah. So there we go. What's up next? Oh, which Jackson would you rather do a duet with, Jermaine, Tito, or Marlon? That's a tough one. I know. Hmm. Mm hmm. Maybe t I think Jermaine for me. I used to love Tito. You did? I don't okay. Know why? Okay. But I, I uh, remember right. thinking as a young girl, mm -hmm. I liked Michael. So you want Tito. to? Well, let me, but Michael's gone. Michael's, yeah. Michael's, yeah. Not Michael's out of the picture. So I so think so I would do probably Jermaine because I remember Jermaine? hearing some of his. Yeah. Um, he was dynamite. Yes. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. did some really great music. He did. So. He definitely did. All right. I'll and give Tito a shot. You're going to give Tito a shot? <laughs> Tito's got those boys, 3T. They had a hit for a minute. There you go. There you go. Okay, Tito. There you go. All right. What's up next? Who would you rather have as your stylist, Rihanna or Lady Gaga? I, I already know the answer to this. Rihanna for me. Yes. Lady Gaga is a little bit more out there than okay. I would like. You don't want to wear a meat dress? I don't want to wear a meat dress. Okay. I don't want to look like a hot air balloon, <laughs> you know, who's getting gotcha. ready to take that off. That is not either. Trey Chic. That's not Trey Chic. That's Understood. Not me. <laughs> Listen. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to say Rihanna. Okay. However, uh -oh. I have to say that Lady Gaga. Yeah. Even though she's over the top, mm -hmm. when she scales it back, she is beautiful. Uh, is she? There's no doubt about she that. She's beautiful. When she's ready to be a, she a take classic some of them feathers, woman, she does Correct. it. Correct. I will oh, say that, that poof poof. Yeah, the poofy yeah, poof. The poof poof mind. That <laughs> it's a, I mind. It's a much. But Rihanna is always on point. Rihanna is always on she point. Is. She's always right. gorgeous. Even in the potato sack, she like does something yes. to make it work. And so. when yeah. she goes over the top, it's mm -hmm. over the top, but it's always like yeah. very tasteful. Classy, it is. Classy, tasteful. Mm -hmm. You understand it as I agree. opposed to you know yeah, no, walking around looking like the art and art museum. I agree. I'm getting to know you ladies so well. I'm loving this. What's up next? Whose celebrity fragrance would smell better, Charlie Sheen or Post Malone? Who do you want to smell like? I, you know, I really don't want to smell like either of them. Understood. I know, yeah. But if I must choose, mm -hmm. I think that Post Malone may have a better fragrance I, out there. Okay. What do you think, Cynthia? 
I agree, Post Malone. Post Malone? Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all gonna be smelling like you're burning trees, though. You know? uh, yeah, yeah, but you know, I don't want to <laughs> smell like tequila. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 exactly. Tequila and prostitutes. Tequila and prostitutes and cigarettes is not gonna happen. Has he scaled that back any? I think he supposedly has. I mean, I think he's still a little. I thought I heard that he was in recovery. I think we're always in recovery. Exactly, correct. Yeah, it's. I think it's 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 a work in progress. What's up next? Ooh, who would you rather go on a couple's trip with? Janelle and David from Teen Mom. He apparently killed the family dog with a gun in front of the children. Oh, Donald and Melania Trump or Kim and Kanye? I'll definitely take Kim and Kanye. Kim and Kanye. You would? Yeah. Really, why? Because I'm not going anywhere with the couple in the middle. Okay, I'm no Trump's okay. You're killing dogs and animals in front of your yeah. kids. I can't be no. around you got a problem. Either. But now if you went with the couple in the middle, you could probably free her because some people think she needs to be free. We'll leave it they at that. They might say that we were kidnapping her <laughs> oh, or something, that, that we were holding her for ransom. We're going to leave that for somebody else. Idea. Okay. <laughs> thank Understood. You, no, thank, thank you. Thank you, but no, thank you. We now, tend Kim to get and yeah, that's true. Now, Kim and Kanye, you don't think you look crazy? You know, she's trying to make sure that he stays stable. Okay, so and stays on the meds, God right? You know, <laughs> she's his grinding that up. And, yeah. Exactly. Okay. You think she's grinding up in his little smoothie every morning? Something. Baby something. drink this? Something, because if she could stay all this time, you know, something's working. That is true. And I think we have one more. Do we have one more? Okay, well, if that is that, how did you guys very quickly, how did you get into being Trey Chic? Like, where, when did you decide, I'm going to just do this and, and chart my own destiny? I, w I was out, and, you know, I was always being the mom and very mm -hmm. practical and everything like that. You're and, a mom? Oh, my gosh, yes, I'm how, a mom. How old are your kids? My daughter is going to be 20 years old. Okay. And my son is just turned 19 years old. You clearly moisturize. You look great. <laughs> thank I'm you. Thank you, you very There is no much. crackage there, America. So, you know, <laughs> we tend to overlook ourselves. Okay. So about, you know, maybe a year and a half ago, I was like, you know, I'm so tired of this because you go to places and you see people with, you know, their $25,000 watches yeah. and stuff like that. And I'm saying, you know, I don't think that's practical. I don't think right. that's good. But what is it that I can do? Okay. Mm -hmm. And I said, you know, we can, I can still be fabulous. Got we yeah. can still be fabulous. Yep. Yes. And it doesn't take a lot. Nope. Okay. So that's how it pretty much started. I love it. And then, it. you know, I just started to, women started reaching yeah. out to me. Okay. And we just started talking and, you okay. know, just us supporting one another and always helping us to look our best and to okay. feel our best. That's a beautiful story. And I want to hear more about yours in just a moment. But okay. we've got to take a very quick commercial break so we'll be back with some more Rudy's room don't go anywhere and hello Gretchen Pina Breedy we love you all right <laughs>
Welcome to Rudy's Room here at Strong Island TV. We've got Cynthia, the Bling Queen, and the lovely Daphne from Trey Chic. Daphne, you changed your jewelry. I did. I just what wanted is to this? show you show guys a couple That's of pieces. Beautiful. All right, ladies okay. and gentlemen, so here we are. What is this called? So here we do call it our Pearls of Wakanda. Okay, yes. Wakanda forever. Pearls of Wakanda, Wakanda <laughs> That's right. forever. Yes, so it's actually handmade pearls. We have them uh, available in pearl, green, as well as yellow. That's beautiful. Oh, and yeah. about what is that? So this cost? piece runs for fifty dollars. Okay, that's worth it. Yeah, Listen, absolutely. It's Wakanda. Yes, okay. yes, absolutely. Okay, this back from the motherland. Dollars. Mm -hmm. And then I don't know if you saw that yeah, other. You piece had another that I had. piece on before. What was I that? I did. I had the blue empress. Okay. So this one the was. Blue empress. Yeah. So Meghan this one's Markle. only forty dollars. Okay. Yeah, and it's very nice. That, very regal. That's it goes actually with pretty everything. cool one on top of the other. Absolutely. Okay. You know? So, yeah, and you, you can look like you're straight out of coming to America. I like <laughs> We are royalty. We yes, are. We I are. like that. And Cynthia, what's going on with you? What do you got? Well, today I have on, I changed actually, I have on um, the pearl earrings okay. set in silver. Gotcha. And it comes with, uh, these earrings are separately. Yep. These are $5. And also the pearl necklace. Okay. And I just want to say that all of our jewelry is nickel and lead free. Okay. Um, Why is lead bad? A lot of people have sensitivities and allergies to certain things, gotcha. so paparazzi has gone out of their way to make sure that they don't put any lead or nickel in any of their jewelry. Okay, gotcha. So, and yes, and then I had on my bling bracelets. Bling? Yes, they bling. Listen, and we stack them. Yeah. Okay. So, I love that. Yeah, you okay. stack. So I need advice from both of you, uh, and we'll start with Daphne first. What's a good gift among your inventory for someone that you know you're not really feeling, but you kind of got to get them a gift? Mm. Like I don't want to spend a lot of money, but right. you know. We definitely have some simple pieces. We okay. have some lovely earrings. Okay. Um, that are we have a lot of bling pieces. So like a mother-in-law, not mine. I do love her, but like, what would you get? <laughs> what would I get? We have some simple pearl strands. Okay. We have some, you know, it depends on her style. So okay. some people like things a little bit more conservative. Okay. Some people like things a little bit more bold. Okay. So we do carry both. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. so, so we have a little something for everyone. I'm not like really feeling her, and I don't want to spend a lot of money. Like, give me, like, give me, a, like, what, like, like, what, what, the, the we Empress, have this uh, pearl. The Duchess, what? We have a, a pearl. It, it's almost like a pearl Louis Vuitton. Okay. Necklace. Gotcha. And it goes to about right here. And okay. it's kind of like, actually, you know, you can kind of double it up. Okay. And it's very simple. Gotcha. But lovely. Okay. Thank you. Um, Cynthia, I don't really like Bobby in the back who <laughs> runs our station. Okay. What's a good gift for him? Well, we do have men and women. We do have, um... Well, give me a nice cheap gift for Bobby. Who doesn't well, get me anything? Oh, yeah. I, I, don't, I, will, I don't say that paparazzi is cheap. I say it's affordable. Oh, okay, well, give me an affordable gift for Bobby it's who's affordable. never given me anything. So we do have... <laughs> we, uh, we do have um, beads. Okay. They're black. Some of them are black onyx. Okay. And some of them are brown, like okay. the tiger's eye. Okay. And a lot of men are wearing them now. Okay. So what we're telling our it's only five dollars, right? It's only five. Because I don't, I'm not investing we much. We tell in a him. lot of our male customers okay. if you double them up, they look. But that's fabulous. ten dollars. Yes. Well, I'm not spending ten dollars on him. Then just get one. Okay, get him one. Okay, well I get ten. I, I'll spend one on me and then one on him. Okay. <laughs> just get one. We could do that. All right, that works. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Excellent. What's the website if I want to get Bobby a gift? www.glamourgirlgems.online. Okay, and then how do I get the gift for the person I'm not so that fond of? You would go to Tracy ZBC at Instagram. Okay, mm -hmm. and now on the flip side, if there's someone that I really like, like like I want to get my wife something, so what would I get for her? What do you, you recommend? You want to get your wife something? I would definitely recommend something like this. The Empress. Something like the Blue Empress. Okay. Um, and we also have some beautiful rings. Oh. We have gorgeous okay. rings. Um, okay. I'm always messing up the size though. So like, what's the best way to do that? Mm. So we do have a sizer. It's like a key ring, and okay. then it has a bunch of different sizes to help you out. Gotcha. Um, but okay. Yeah. All right. So probably stick with the necklace. I would I don't definitely the stick with the necklace. Okay. Stick with some earrings. We have okay. some beautiful earrings. Sounds good. And then and then from from your brand. Well, we also have an exclusive. <clears throat> it's an exclusive collection. It's oh, we like exclusive Z, Z collection. Okay. Everything is bigger, bolder, better, and it's twenty five dollars plus tax. Okay. If you'd like a ring, our rings come with a stretchy. If I can't get a ring from her, I can't get it from you. Yes, you can because <laughs> okay. our rings um, come with the, the stretchy band. Okay. So it fits size six to nine. Okay. Average and if fingers. Bobby actually got me a gift and then I want to like make it better than the one he gave me, like what do you got? Um. Because I can't let him get me a good gift and I've only gotten the $5. You can go thing. in between. I mean, everything, mostly everything we sell is $5. Okay. But if you want to go exclusive, it's $25. Okay. So what I would tell Bobby is maybe uh -huh. to get you 
Uh, nice. You're not getting me anything. I get, it, it, suppose he surprised me with a <laughs> gift. I can't come with a five dollar thing if he's giving me like a thirty dollar thing. So I got like. Absolutely right. Yeah. So we. Because then I look bad. <laughs> you're absolutely right. Okay. So as I was gonna say, mm -hmm. then if you just double those bands up. Okay. Then it's fifteen dollars and or twenty dollars. Okay. There, there you go. go. We got something for Bobby. Yes. Okay. You guys, very quickly though, there are some people out there who'll do anything for attention, and as we like to say here, the thirst is real, and so we've <laughs> got some folks who are, as I would call it, victims of dehydration. Up first is twenty-five-year-old Megan Holman. Um, believe it or not, Megan was recently um, pulled over and arrested for public intoxication. Um, now the crazy part about Miss Megan was she was spotted driving down the street in an electric power wheels toy truck <laughs> drunk she, uh, uh, she, she might have been i mean that was a mess she was spotted doing that the police pulled her over and and just she was just a mess so megan that was really sad then there is kevin bacon not the actor i was about to say um, not the actor i thought so too but this one is actually just as bad he's a 55 year old driver in vermont that police for drivers looking uh, at their phone this comes because because after they say a man hit a stopped ran police into cruiser on i-91 because while driving his he was vehicle. searching for he apparently was a victim of distracted driving because mr bacon while driving was trying to stream an episode of the tv show saved by the bell <laughs> Really, Mr. Bacon? Mr. Bacon, what yes. Saved by the think. Bell, mm -hmm. Mr. Bacon? Yes, Saved by the Bell. And in particular, he was trying to find the episode called Screech's Spaghetti Sauce. So I don't understand it. I don't know why I couldn't wait. But he had to see that episode while he was driving, um, which I thought was bizarre. And then this one actually happened, I think, about a week or so ago. But it still surprises me that this even happens. Tiffany Adams was recently on an Air Canada flight. Mm. She went to sleep. And woke up. I heard about and this. was on the plane, the plane with by, the, herself. by herself with the lights out and trapped. And by had herself. To text a friend to get her off the plane. What I don't understand is if they check school buses, why are they not checking airplanes? What do you think about that, Cynthia? Somebody didn't do their job. Uh, I mean, they said she was all the way in the back and mm -hmm. she was laying down because the seat next to her was empty. Okay. I heard it on the news and mm -hmm. I'm like, how do you get trapped on an airplane? Right. When they're supposed to go seat by seat. That's like, what I don't understand. A lot of people didn't do their job. I would think not. Oh, I mean, yeah. But now there's some people who are thinking that maybe all of this, because now she, of course, has like post traumatic stress and she can't like work a little bit. She's they having said she nightmares. hung out of the plane. Yeah. Like, how, first of all, how'd you get that big door open? Right. Am I something the only one that smells a lawsuit? Something's wrong with that something. story. There's definitely mm -hmm. a lawsuit there. Mm -hmm. and she knows I understand. Yeah. So, like I said, I was also wondering, I mean, if they do check school buses, why don't they check planes? The other part is, like, while she was waiting, do you think she was able to get more than one bag of peanuts? Because you know how they're real stingy with the chips and stuff? <laughs> Right? She treated her all the way wrong. I would think time. so. Uh, right? I don't know. So our nominees this week, uh, we've got Megan Holman, the Power Wheels chick. We've got Kevin Bacon, of course, not the actor who loves Saved by the Bell. And then we've got Miss Tiffany Adams. And the winner of this week's mug, the thirstiest of them all, is... No. <laughs> it's Miss Tiffany. Yes, you win the mug because I, th I'm a little suspect. I'm with Miss Cynthia. I don't yeah. understand it. I think there's something up with that. Something's definitely, something's up, with definitely that. up with that. Something's wrong. How did you get into doing paparazzi and being the bling queen? Well, I started buying it. Um, okay. One of my friends was selling How it. How much were you buying? I was buying way too much. Okay. And she, you were thrown uh, down at 20 and just going listen, crazy, right? And she said to me, listen, you have the personality, you have the style. Okay. Let's be business partners. Okay. This is how you can do it. Mm -hmm. And I thought about it for a while and I thought, ah, let's see what happens. Okay. So I, I invested, okay. which was really not a lot of money. Well, if it's $5, what you invest in? 40 well, bucks? You can, you can do a starter kit, which is $99. $99? $99. You get 35 pieces of jewelry. It, okay. All right. You get thirty-five okay. pieces of jewelry. Math is is slow on it, but okay. <laughs> yep. Sold at Sounds five dollars. Right. Mm -hmm. Two hundred bucks. Okay. So you make your you make the ninety-nine dollars okay. back plus a plus a profit. Okay. Nice. So I I started doing it, and one thing led to another, and did you make a profit right away? Absolutely. Okay. I sold those thirty-five pieces of jewelry within within two days. Oh, nice. Now, is this yeah. what you wear like to the supermarket and stuff? Like, are you pretty much? Okay, you rolling yeah. around. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. now, are you Trey Sheeking it at the la laundromat and all of that? Or I'm definitely not Trey Sheeking it like this at the laundromat. Okay. But... No. Okay. <laughs> where, where does this go? Like, where where do we wear this? Um, this can go really anywhere. This can go to dinner. This can go to drinks. Okay. You know, this can go to a, a barbecue where gotcha. you know this can okay. go to a first communion. Anything. Nice. Girls night out. Okay. And then where do you 
Papa Urazi? <laughs> everywhere, everywhere. Every, I okay. sell my jewelry everywhere. Okay, nice. Every, literally, literally in the shopping lot. Uh, the shopping. You doing Where deals in the I parking lot? Today. Yeah, in the parking lot. Where was I at? <laughs> Shoprite. In Shoprite. In Shoprite. Okay. Yo. The lady said, "I, I, I seen you someplace before." Okay. And I, we started talking. You did a deal. Yes. Okay. You have like one of those big trench coats where you like open it up and pull it. You look in my car right now. Uh -huh. You will know that I sell paparazzi jewelry. I go. like yeah. that. Good mm -hmm. for you. Excellent. Now, do you both find that you give people gifts from your product oh, lines? All the time. People are always asking for things. They Absolutely. are. Okay. Yeah. Excellent. And then, do you do those parties like where you go to someone's yes. house and stuff? Or? I love to do them. Okay. What was the best party? that you've ever done not even necessarily money wise i mean you can say the money wise but i'm very curious like in terms of just i had a lot of fun with those ladies or men or people or whatever mm. i love doing the girls nights where the women just get together okay. at the house yeah. and they just want to have a good time okay. and you know shop and do some you know get some exclusive things gotcha. they want to treat themselves okay nice and you i think my biggest one not financially yeah um just for my spirit okay was when i did the assisted living um home okay the little little ladies there, they're so nice, they're welcoming, mm -hmm. and you know, um, they asked me to come back. Okay. So I'm already slotted for September, October, and November. Well, she's coming at you, yes. little ladies. Oh, yeah. And we're coming back at yes. you in just a moment. Advice Hour is next on Rudy's Room. Don't go anywhere, Rude Rangers. We love you for watching. Don't forget to like and share. Hi, Aurora. Hi, Gretchen. Hi, LaBelle. Hi, Julia. And hi, Kim Palmer watching. We love you. Me llaman Tan Pablo y hace más de 20 años me enamoré de una colombiana. Viajé a su país y conocí un estilo de café muy distinto, muy especial. Ahora tostamos cafés excelentes, con alturas y microclimas diferentes, resultado en una taza muy compleja y muy rica, un sabor nuevo en el mundo. Fue un éxito. And I even got to keep the girl. someone you know is in the area and you want to see our show, order your free tickets today. Go to www.rudysroomshowtickets.eventbrite.com. Welcome back to Rudy's Room. I, of course, I'm your host, Mr. Rudy. We've got Daphne, we've got Cynthia, and we've got a viewer that needs some advice. You ladies ready to help me? Absolutely. Yes. Well, not help me, but help, help this person. <laughs> okay, advice hour starts now. music get any more dramatic. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, hi there. I'm involved with my ex-husband's former best friend who is 32. I'm 47. My ex has no idea that me and his friend are together. When I told my guy about my plans to disclose our relationship to my ex, he asked me not to because they still work together. My ex is actually his boss. Oh. Rudy, I'm developing serious feelings for this man. He's recently divorced, has two children, both younger than mine. When we get together, we almost always grab drinks and then end up at his house until the next morning. I feel so comfortable and safe with him and don't want to lose that by sharing our relationship with my ex and then making things rough for him at work. 
Do you think my man sees this as a nothing, as nothing more than a friendship with benefits? Is there a chance this could develop into something more? I'm nervous every time I raise the subject for fear he'll walk away from this bond that we share. Whenever I see him talking is really not what we are both looking for, and we immediately default to sex. The few times this subject has been discussed, I've mentioned to him that he makes me feel wonderful and that our time together is incredible. I've also said I don't want him to ever leave my life, and he replies, don't worry, we'll always be friends. Rudy, <laughs> I'm so unsure what to do. He's a good man, and the time we're together is so special, even if it's only that to me. He's also known me with my ex-husband for close to 12 years. We used to spend time together as two married couples. What do I do? Signed, Worried, in Wamsutta, Wyoming. Where is Wamsutta, Wyoming? Okay, anyway, I digress. Um, Cynthia? Ah. Uh. She needs so. to stop. <laughs> Why does she need to stop? <laughs> well, first of all, she wants something that he's he's not ready for. Uh huh. And he's telling her he's he's telling her, and she's missing all the signs. Okay. So uh, I don't, and I don't think mm -hmm. nobody should be telling anybody anything. Okay. Don't tell and nobody it, anything. Nope. And Keep I think it moving. it's strictly a. He's thinking strictly a booty call. He's thinking booty call. Yeah. Okay. Get that drink and then do the yeah. thing. Do to do. Um, you don't want nothing else. Okay. Daphne. It's so messy. Why it is are messy. we still even? Or why is she? Why are people still entertaining things like that? Why I, are women yeah. still entertaining things like that? Just because people are allowing, you know. People are playing these games. We don't yeah. have to participate. I would think not, but I mean, I guess he's feeling a need somehow. Somewhere. Yeah. Somewhere. There's so many people <laughs> out there. There's so many fish in the sea. Go right. travel and meet somebody else. You don't need right. to go into your ex-husband's backyard. And That's pick true. Up Especially as employee. Leftover. No, yeah. I agree. That is messy. So many yeah. people. I'm curious how the conversation even took place. Because if you were hanging out for 12 years as two married couples, like how do you even get into that space where you're doing the drinks and very comfortable? Up in the back. I mean, that very is comfortable. comfortable. Too. That's yeah. too comfortable. Very comfortable too with comfortable. Each comfortable. Other. Yes. And you know, his ex-wife is not feeling any of this. No. If she found Never. out, that no, would be a problem. Not. Now right? that's messy. That's messy. That's a messy, that's messy. problem. Yes. Messy, messy problem. Shout out to LaBelle Bell. I'm glad you like my kneecaps. And, and Miss Aurora, yes, it is hot here. And yes, I'm wearing the shorts. It, it got to let things breathe, but that's a whole other thing. Um, <laughs> Daphne, so do people, I mean, I just wonder, because you guys, you, you talk to customers, you have a regular client base. People start telling you all their problems. Like, do you get in the business? Not that you necessarily look into, but do people just start running off at the mouth sometimes? No. Okay, no. It's not like a hairdresser? No, no. Okay. Sometimes I might run into someone who's not having a good day. Okay. I think I'm able to look at them and mm -hmm. kind of, oh, yeah. uh, okay. you know, see where they're at. And I gotcha. just, you know, hi, how are you doing? What's the matter? Are you okay? Let's put a smile on that face. <laughs> right. right, okay. Yeah. You know? Gotcha. Now, yeah. what do you wear? Because you didn't change it up again. I did change it up <laughs> again. So this is one of our... You're like Diana Ross at a concert. It's like she just keeps there's changing. There's a lot to bring out. You know, I There's like a lot it. to show you guys. I wanted to make sure that I was able to show you guys, you know, some yeah. of our newer items. So this is like a Versace and inspired piece it's beautiful remember you know all the lion heads yeah, and everything that's yeah, what yeah, actually yeah. so we've got the Rest necklace piece versace yeah. that was a great Gianni show on versace. fx by the way mm -hmm. didn't yeah. you love yeah. it i did i mean andrew Kanan and he was a killer oh my god crazy it's so good it was good i know yeah right? so and it also has a matching bracelet it does yeah it does okay so it looks like that basically same exact okay now wow. how much does it cost to have versace so you're gonna do both the bracelet as well as the chain for sixty dollars okay Nice. Yeah. All right. And and now, do you have a favorite piece of your jewelry line? What, what so is I it? Do I have a favorite piece? I would say one of my favorite pieces is mm -hmm. probably a Z Collection piece. It's okay. a higher end. Gotcha. And it's called the Marissa. And okay. It's called the Marissa. And do they have a Shaquita? No. <laughs> we don't oh, have goodness. a Shaquita. Tawana? However, no. However. <laughs> Kilolo? Um, no. I will do be, you remember Kilo? I do remember Kilo. Of course. I will be, um, I will be showing <laughs> that piece on the 25th. Okay, you'll be showing that. Yes. Okay, so she makes her debut on the 25th. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's your favorite. And what about your line? Is it like, would this be your favorite piece, or do you have another? What's your favorite? I think the pearls that I had on right before okay. this one is probably one gotcha. of my favorite pieces. I love that piece. Okay. Do you have, not to say a least favorite piece, but one that you're almost like, wow, I can't believe how many people really like that piece. Like, it's a hot demand. <laughs> yes. Okay, yeah. what's yours? Um, it's this little, it's just a little silver necklace that has like a leaf on it. Mm -hmm. And it's just one long leaf. Okay. And to me, I'm like, nah. Nah? To me. Right. But, I, oh, yeah. but everyone's different. They love it. Okay. People have said, you know that leaf necklace? I go, oh, yeah, I got it. Okay. I got it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because okay. people just ask for it. And, and you know what they say to me? What? I like plain. Sometimes I like simple. I can wear this every day. Okay. Like somebody, 
I would wear this to work. Okay, so you would wear this to work. Oh, absolutely. You're not they, working at Wendy's or anything, no, right? <laughs> okay. No, but they think I'm crazy. Gotcha. And I, and I okay. think I'm just a walking advertisement. Okay. So many people on my job when I started wearing this jewelry, uh -huh. like, where'd you get that from? I said, okay. I had the trunk of my car. Really? And on the break, yeah, I you got go to one the trunk for of your car. Too. No way. Every day. Okay, so uh, every, every day. day. Every day. Every day. Okay. Now, are you allowed to share? Like, what is your real job? Uh, my real job is I am a housing case manager for the mentally ill. So you wearing all of this in front of the mentally ill? Yeah, they ain't got nothing to do with this. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I go okay. other places. I take okay. them other establishments. Got you. I, you know, I'm out in the field, so I'm not in the office. Okay. So I do field work. So got I'm you. out in the field all day, every okay. day. Gotcha. I love that. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Uh, do you wear this hair with the mentally ill? Uh, yes, I do. It's very nice. <laughs> Thank okay, you. Look at that. What's her name? Um... She doesn't really have a Shantae, name. Shantae, no? No, I okay. just like her, though. I like her. She does I love something her. when I put she her does. on. She does. She's fabulous. She looks fabulous. She does look fabulous. She reminds I like me of uh, an early Audrey Hepburn. Yes, she does. Yeah, right? Yeah. Something, something. Yeah. A little it's a little Diana, little too. I can see a little side. Diana Ross Absolutely. in you. Yeah. Definitely. Actually, yes. this is one of my favorites. I, it is. I picked it up on a whim, and I was like, mm, I put it on my own. Wait a minute. Feeling yourself. Wait a minute. Now, now, does yeah. she have her own little head at home? And, and a she's whole got a, little station. A whole little station? Okay. Yeah, okay. I put it down every mm -hmm. night. And do you fluff her? I and, fluff, and her. fluff her. I fluffed her before I got out of okay. the car. Her Just to make sure she was all right. <laughs> Stay in your lane, girl. Stay in your... <laughs> Treat her right, she'll do you right. That's right. right. That's yep. great. Now, wh wh which of your girls is the longest? I don't really do long. Like no Pocahontas? This, no. no, this is probably it. Okay. Yeah, this is probably it for me. Got gotcha. you. Um, I've done a lot shorter. So you ain't got no Indian in your family? No. Okay, you don't do that. Okay, no. got you. I, okay. I, I'm just, I don't, I You can't. don't want all of that? No. Okay, you're not trying <laughs> to toss. Listen, the, I get hot a lot. Got gotcha. you. So the back of my neck got to be free. It's going to be, give us free. free. Give us yes. free. Yes, okay. listen, when you get a certain age. Yeah. Yeah, Things understand. start to happen, mm -hmm. so you just need a little freedom. Look, we want you to be free, Amistad. Thank um, you. So, be free. Now, in terms of the outfits and stuff that you guys sell, like, what do you have a favorite outfit? So I, this is definitely one of my favorite outfits. Okay, it's outfits. great on you. Okay. Nice I, like, we just got it in, yeah. and I love the yellow and the brightness okay. and the flowers. Do you get a deal on them, or you got to pay 50 bucks? Me, myself? Yeah. Oh, I mean, you know, I... I'm just... I, I mean... The, the deal is it's not... Worth the 50, I don't really get a deal on it, no. You because. Don't. You know what it is? Again, I'm just really trying to help. I want everyone to look and feel great. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So I'm not really, okay. you know what I mean? So yeah. it's not about making our pockets fat. It's Understood. about helping everyone okay. to feel and be the best them that you. they can be. So when you see someone that's aesthetically challenged, yes. do you like slip them your card? What do you like? What do you do? How do you how do you help them? To be honest with you, how do I help them is yeah. try to befriend them. Okay. Okay, encourage right. them, meet them where they're at. Got gotcha. you. Now, Absolutely. if you want okay. to inquire within, if, okay. you, if I can help so rub a little bit Filene's off basement on you. And lift them out of it. Okay. I find you at Filene's basement and I'm helping you go through the racks it's and figuring out how we're going to get this together. Yeah, exactly. Get and then together. afterwards, yeah. I'll help you get a piece to set it off. Okay. But we can stay at Filene's <laughs> yeah. and get what you need to get gotcha. for that price that you need okay. to do. Absolutely. I like that. Excellent. Yeah, sure. Okay, that's good. I and love Filene's. Or when it was right when it was around. No, I wish. Do you Marshalls? Do you TJ Maxx? I'm Marshalls. I TJ Maxx. You know, again, I'm a mom, and okay. the kids are always growing, and they were, yeah. they're were they huge. Okay. So, you know, yeah. always find deals, always find great clothes. Okay. They always have great brands. Yeah. Gotcha. You know, I have this cute little Betsy Johnson bag. Mm -hmm. Everywhere I carry it, everybody loves, loves it. it. Okay. Loves it. A little Betsy Johnson that I found at Marshalls. Really? For like maybe $25. Wow. Wow. And now, Miss Cynthia, do you have kids? Yes, I do. Are they as blinged out as you? I have sons, so no. No, they don't bling? <laughs> no. They don't even, the no, tiger No, they don't bling, but they let me know that I am blinging. That you're there blinging. You okay. They support I, okay. mom. I have two sons. One is 38 and okay. one is 20. Weren't you there? 26. Okay. <laughs> I had to think about it because we just recently had a birthday. Okay. Yeah, 26, 27, something like that. Listen, when they get a certain age. You just forget yeah, it. Right? I have yeah, I have five grandsons. I can't remember. Yes. Five grandsons? Yes. All right, oh, Grandma. Wow. Yes. Looking good. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Yes, Look I have you. five grandsons. Okay, so then now these daughter-in-laws, are they? What are you talking about? Oh. Oh. That's a totally Ooh, different story. That's a story. whole advice letter, huh? We oh. We ain't talking about that. Okay. What kind of gifts you getting for them? Uh-oh. <laughs> We're going to leave that one alone. We're going to leave that one alone. She the babies. It's, it's all about the babies. I love my grandsons. Yes, yes, you do. Okay. Mm -hmm. They're just okay. a gift. They're a gift. Mm, definitely. You that. might want to move that tree up with some more shade. <laughs> <laughs>
need some more shade. <laughs> Too funny. I'm sipping uh, on the tea. Exactly, on the tea. Um, what's the largest party that you've actually had with your brand? The largest party that yeah. we've actually mm -hmm. had? So one time we did an event for about th about 300 people. 300 people? Yeah, it was like a huge nursing convention. Mm -hmm. Wow. So that was awesome. It was very exciting. Those nurses must have gone crazy they over They were stuff. having so much fun okay. because we also, like I said, we have some clothes. So yep. they were, And we also carry some men items, some items for men. What? We have fedoras, we have pocket squares, we Get have ties, absolutely. So you've got a gift I can give to Bobby in the back? I have gifts you could give to Bobby in the back. Okay, but absolutely. I don't have a lot of money yet, because he didn't get he, me anything. He won't know. Okay. But he'll think you spent a <laughs> he lot of money think, on okay, it. Because so that's what it's all about. That's exactly what it's all, yes. about. all about. Give me a good suggestion. What, what, can, we, what can we get for him? I, you know, I saw Bobby that was just out yeah. here, mm -hmm. the gentleman, the very nice gentleman. He's I not nice, him. but that's okay. A fedora, I think, would be perfect, especially okay. for this season. So we've got like blue, we have white, okay. there's straw fedoras. Okay. He was fashion challenged, and then I helped him. He, I, 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 I got him a suit and everything. I, I did. I, I mean, I lifted him up. Okay. There you go. So we'll fedora him. Yeah. Okay. And him. then we'll get one of your $5 pieces too. That's right. And, and I'll be covered. <laughs> yes. Look at that. Excellent. Okay. And for those husbands out there like myself who don't always do so hot with the gifts, what do you recommend as a good, what's a good I'm sorry gift? From each of your lines the necklace that i first had on okay it's called miss universe okay and it gives her just enough bling mm -hmm. to make her feel to sit up straight to sit up straight because okay. that when you wear that necklace yeah. when you walk in the room people mm -hmm. like whoa okay where she get that necklace where she get that okay all right okay so miss universe miss universe and then from trey chic what, what's a good i'm sorry gift? a good i'm sorry gift would probably be one of our rings okay. we have a lot of um really big like diamond rings mm -hmm. two carat three carat four carat mm -hmm. so instead of you going out to spend thirty thousand dollars on that four carat <laughs> ring oh, yeah because you could happen. easily bring it home and say honey <laughs> right. this is what i got you okay you know and then you know just make sure that you know you take okay. it off before you go to bed and don't get it wet don't get, <laughs> don't get it wet because <laughs> <Don't get it laughs> you know you bought it for under a hundred dollars so right. you know Understood. Okay. absolutely <laughs>Okay, the powers that be want us to know that it's last call, so we're going to wrap this up in just a second. Very quickly, um, what is a good just because gift? Really quick. A good just because gift? Mm -hmm. um, I like the idea of the fedora because okay. you can do either for a female or mm -hmm. for a male. Yep. You know, and it's just because. And then you okay. put it on and it's like it brings the party. Okay, gotcha. And what about you? Um, just because for a, man, for a man, we have some nice thick bracelets okay. for a woman, mm -hmm. a nice pair of chandelier earrings. Okay, sounds good. Julie Montero Johnson, you're right. If you're really sorry, you need to buy lots of jewelry from these ladies. <laughs> ladies, really quick, give your information to these guys. They'll also post things on the Facebook feeds. So you can find them. And we're also going to do more with them on our after show on YouTube. So check it out. But quickly, how do they find you? www.glamourgirlgems.online. Okay. And Trey Chic. At Trey Chic. DBC at Instagram. And you will see them at our passion party coming up on July 25th. Fabulousness, lots of fun stuff. Some of you commenting on the feed, you will get a chance to interact with them as well. Thank you guys so much. I'm really, really appreciate that you're watching Rudy's Room. Again, our after show is gonna be on YouTube. Go to Rude Rangers TV. We're gonna have even more wild fun with these ladies. We love you for watching. Let's wave goodbye. Bye. Rudy, Rudy, Rudy. Right, keep it going, keep it going.